Here you go, sweetheart. Some tea will do you good. Thank you. I'm going out for a while, Kelly. Is there anything I can bring back for you? No. Okay. No, no, I'm fine. Okay. No. She is not fine. She needs her family with her. I won't be long. Just some old business contacts want to meet with me. I will be back before you know it, okay? You're being so brave. Isn't she, Blair? You took the words right out of my mouth. How does my mother's heart just give out like that? I never heard the doctors, anyone, ever say a word about a heart condition. No, neither did I. I was just hoping Star would call because, you know, um... Hope hasn't been feeling uh, well, so... I just spoke to Star, and Hope's getting over a bag hold. Yeah, I know, but, you know, with all the flu going around... Langston, I, just... I know that you're dealing with some stuff with Ford, so yesterday, when Star couldn't find you, I just wondered, maybe, were you with him? Oh, honey... I can't talk to Star about this. She'd hate me. I mean, why wouldn't she? I hate me. Oh, Langston, you didn't, did you? I did. I did it. I slept with Ford. I'm so, I'm so sorry. It's all right. I love Ford. I love Marco. Marco trusted me. How could I cheat on him? It happens. Not to me. It doesn't. Well, at least you know what you want. Yeah. And you want Marco. I do. I do want Marco. He's so good and kind and decent and Ford. And, I mean, he knew that Dorian's sister died and he didn't even see if I was okay. Yeah, I know. But you know what? Guys like that, you know, unfortunately, you're just going to be another roll in the hay. And the sooner that you get, I'm sorry, but the sooner you understand that and get over that creep, sweetie, the better. Hello? Hi, gorgeous. Miss me? Why? Well, because I miss you. All I can think about is seeing you again. Uh, tell you what, Christian's leaving the apartment in a few minutes. Come on over and we can have the whole place to ourselves. I don't think so. Why not? Because I... You'll be here. Feel better? Yes. Because now I know what I have to do. Oh, good. I need to tell Ford that what happened yesterday can never happen again because I love Marco. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Where are you going? I just told you. I'm gonna... No, no. You do not need to go over there and see Ford. Yes, I do. I need to tell him that it's over. No, over is good. Over is what we want. What we don't want you is to use another excuse for you to see him. That is not what I was... Listen, do you want this to be over? Then do it over the phone. So suspicious. <laughs> Look, if anybody's been tempted by the bad boys, it's me. And trust me. They may be beautiful, but they will break your heart every single time. Well, I don't think Ford is that bad. Uh, well, I do, and I did my own personal experiment with him. How personal? Well, it's kind of real personal. I kind of kissed him. What? When? Well, it was the night of actually your birthday party. You know when he came on to you? Well, I thought, well, I'm going to check out what his intentions are. And guess what? I went right up to him and I laid a big, hot, juicy kiss on him. And I tell you what, he liked it. In fact, he wanted more. I don't believe you. Well, okay. You don't? Let's do another little experiment. Bring that. No, what are you doing? No, come on. I'm tested. Bring your phone over here. What? Give me his number. Come on. Let me see. There, there, there it is. Oh, fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. Shh. shh, shh. Hello? Ford, hi. It's Blair. 
Listen, if this is about Langston, I can... Oh, no. It's actually about me and that certain intimate moment that we shared. And ever since then, you know what? I just have not been able to get you out of my mind. And uh, I was actually hoping that, I don't know, maybe you could come over here and put me out of my misery. Okay, so how do I allude? I think you shouldn't have gone through all the trouble because Ford's not even going to see it. Sweetie, you think he only has eyes for you? I think it takes more than just a phone call to get him to come running. Well, um, I'm sorry that you're going to have to learn the hard way, sweetie, but you don't worry. Don't worry. I promise you, it's all going to be okay. Just let me take care of this. You want to know 